Never in the field of human conflict was so much owed by so many to so few. The London borough of Croydon, which for many residents is still Surrey, extends into the North Downs, its border ending at Caterham. Included within this region are several areas of open country, categorised as South London Downs, that include Kenley Common, adjacent to Kenley Airfield. Now this played a significant role during World War II, in particular the Battle of Britain. It was one of three major fighter stations responsible for the air defence of London. The other stations, Croydon and Biggin Hill, are not far away, but Kenley is regarded as the best preserved. From here, pilots were scrambled to protect the capital from the Luftwaffe. Many never returned, but some are remembered in the street names given to a neighbouring housing estate. Aircraft still fly out of Kenley, but today they are much quieter. Helped by lottery funding, display boards around the perimeter now tell Kenley's story. Access is permitted at any reasonable time around the airfield's perimeter on a clear designated path. This is part of Kenley Common that extends beyond the airfield to Whiteleaf Bank with extensive views to Riddlesdown also integrated into South London Downs. There are many footpaths on Kenley Common, and from the airfield's perimeter fence, one has a grandstand view of the action, now the preserve of glider training. For those of us born during or just after World War II, Kenley and other similar sites have a special place in our hearts where many sacrifices were made. On the airfield's western perimeter within the common is the RAF Kenley Tribute, where the fallen are remembered on Armistice Day, or indeed at any time for those wishing to make a personal pilgrimage. Kenley Airfield and Common are not far from where I live, and apart from essential recreation and exercise, I take a camera. Over time I have gathered, somewhat surprisingly in number, many images, which I now put to good use as my own personal tribute, and thanks to those fallen heroes that give me today the freedom to capture its many moods from dawn to dusk.